Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'll be sharing with you what I eat in a day. This morning, I'm having cinnamon tea, um, usually like a capful, and then I am putting Simply Probiotic in this. This is really great to balance the good and bad bacteria in your gut. And then some active fiber in apple flavor. This is really good to just give you your fiber um, intake for the day and help you go to the restroom. I usually add aloe to this mix, but I was actually out and waiting for my order. After I make my tea, I like to go sit outside, sip on it, and enjoy it while I journal and reflect on the day ahead and also write my gratitude list for the day. All right, moving on to breakfast. Today's breakfast, I'm gonna be making Herbalife mug cake with you guys. You start with one egg inside of a mug, and then you're gonna get your Formula One flavor. This morning, I'm using banana caramel just because it comes out super delicious like banana nut bread. And I go ahead and add two scoops right inside of the mug. Now, the next part is optional, but I like to add a little bit of baking powder and some water to get it to, and then whisk it to this consistency that you like. You want it to be like pancake batter. After you're done whisking it, go ahead and pop it into your microwave and set it in there for two minutes. All right, so once it's out of the microwave, you're just gonna carefully flip it out onto a plate. Be careful, it is really, really hot. As you can see, I actually like to let mine cool. Um, I didn't let mine cool enough. You'll see in the next clip when I add the Ready Whip on top, it kind of melts off. So you can kind of top it with Cool Whip, Ready Whip, whatever you like, and just go ahead and squirt that on top. As you can see, there it went, it fell off. I like to add uh, pecans to mine. You can even add almonds, and this is what it looks like. It comes out so delicious, and it's so guilt-free. Hey guys, I'm finally showing my face on here. And I'm going to show you a really quick and easy snack that I do pretty much all the time. All right, so I'm just going to uh, put you guys right here and I'm going to go get everything I need. I get this phage yogurt. I get the 5%. They also make 0%, but I need a little bit of fat, so... Uh, what you're going to do, this one is actually brand new. I'm going to kind of break it up a little bit. And I'm going to get maybe like a big tablespoonful, just like that. Kind of scrape off the excess. Okay. Then I'm going to top it with some blueberries. Top it with some blueberries. A little bit of honey for some sweetness because... This yogurt is definitely not sweet, and this is a um, natural sweetener with lots of uh, benefits for you. And then I don't do this all the time, but I felt like it today. I'm going to add some of this granola. This is the Hemp Ya yeah Granola in Dark Chocolate. You can literally add any granola you like, but just don't overdo it because it does have carbs, and it does have calories, and it does have sugar. So I'll just sprinkle a little bit on top. And that is it, guys. I'm gonna show you what it looks like. All right, so this is what it looks like. It has a good source of protein and it's super healthy for you and delicious. All right, moving on to lunch. Today I had some chicken tacos and I just used the Mission Low Carb Tortillas. They are super delicious. And I bought this shredded chicken from HEB that you just microwave and it's ready to go. And I just added some enchilada sauce, um, sour cream, a little bit of cheese and cilantro. This uh, lunch is super filling, low on carbs and high on protein, which is definitely the goal. So this is what they look like and I just enjoyed two of them. So later that afternoon, my family wanted to go to Orange Leaf. It's a little frozen yogurt place. And of course, life is all about balance. So I just got some vanilla frozen yogurt with strawberries and pineapple. So we all had a win-win here. They got what they liked and I got what I liked. Hey guys, so we came back from Orange Leaf. Um, we've been here for a little while, but I do want to get a workout in. So this is kind of like another part of what I eat in a day. I also take pre-workout sometimes when I'm just kind of feeling tired and I need that extra boost. 
And this is the pre-workout that I really, really have been enjoying at the moment. So this is the one I've been taking. It's by Alani New. It's um, Hawaiian Shaved Ice Flavor. They have um, different flavors as well, but this one's really delicious. Um, if you want to purchase this, I have this in my Amazon storefront. I'll have the link below so you guys can get this. It is amazing. It gives you really, really clean energy without feeling like jittery and no crash at the end. So I'm going to make this really quickly. went ahead and finished my workout in the garage so I'm gonna go ahead and go inside and I'm gonna make me a shake for dinner all right the shake flavor that I'm gonna have today is mango pineapple um, you just do two scoops of the formula one and mango pineapple I actually finished mine off today so I just dumped it in there and then one scoop of vanilla protein I add some ice and this is optional but since I had a good workout I did add a half a frozen banana and then you're just going to go ahead and blend that up to the consistency that you desire. And this is how mine came out. This flavor is super delicious. If you guys have not tried this flavor, you can click the link down below in my description so you can purchase for yourself and try it out. So I stayed up pretty late this night and I got hungry. So I just made me a couple of boiled eggs as a high protein snack. All right, so that was it. Thank you guys so much for watching What I Eat in a Day. I hope you guys got some ideas and I hope this was helpful. If you enjoy these types of videos, please leave me a like and a comment and go ahead and share this video with others and be on the lookout for more videos coming soon. Love you guys.